hey guys welcome back again to my youtube channel my name is vicky thank you so much for clicking on my videos to watch and if you're seeing me for the very first time hi this is your number one amebo your number one asheri your number one aproko on youtube based on big brother Naija. please do well to hit on the red subscribe button join my channel join my family and join my gang i really love to have you by my side as my gist body okay so guys today i came to you guys to actually tell you guys what has been going on in that house like there are things that has actually been going on that we actually have no idea of please 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 like this video before we continue you don't like them all right let's go on so guys yesterday was the eviction night and finally we found out that it was even kid wire that actually sent praise home why because there was a tie between kid wire and watoni and like you know big brother also told us that whenever there is a tie that the head of house will be the one to break that tie by actually choosing who goes home so kid um, praise had six votes and Watoni had six and when Kidwire went in to nominate, he actually nominated Praise which made it the sixth vote and then um, Big Brother was like, okay, there is a tie in both of them. So he, he was like, he should break the tie and then Kidwire was like, fuck it, my goodness. He had to do it. So he said, okay, is he going to vote the person to stay or the person to go? And then Kid, Big Brother was like, you are going to vote the person to go. So does that mean... I vote to send someone home, or I vote to keep them in. You're voting to send them home. Um, praise. Kindly confirm your votes. Praise. Kidwire. Yes, my brother. You must not discuss your votes with anyone. Like you have seen, Kidwire actually voted Praise to go. And I'm like, for some reason, I understand why Kidwire actually voted Praise. Because that Praise has a way of getting under somebody's skin. Praise to the find trouble. Praise to the jabber. Praise to the talk. So that's just it. I think that Kidwire has actually, like, had had a biased mind about him based on most of the conversation he has been hearing about him like bright gossiping him with kidwire which bright actually denied yesterday i was shocked like i could not believe i thought that bright i did not thought i knew that bright no game mind at all bright the fear face you get so i feel like um kidwire has always had this perception that praise is talking too much that praise is proud and all that and it was very easy for him to make a choice which is choosing praise to actually go home between him and watoni and you know that the housemates they are always voting based on who they connect less with you know that's just what happened and then tolani badge and v we were thinking that tolani badge and v were friends but at this very point i, I doubt it because tolani badge actually nominated v to be sent home hello tolani badge hi big brother you have 15 seconds to vote two housemates from the four housemates at risk of eviction for an immediate possible eviction tonight. Your time starts now. So praise and V. Oh. Like Tulani Badge mentioned V and one other person like that and I'm like, oh my God, this is really, 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 really heartbreaking or this is really a betrayal well that's the game i would not say it's a betrayal per se but that is the game and everybody came into the house to actually actually play the game and then the next one i want to be talking about is guys after what Tony was praised before bright it was praised before bright too and i'm like it was just this close because this is like a wake-up call to his people out there this is like he people um his people getting to know just like news people i think the the, the eviction yes last week actually gave news people a wake-up call to be like you guys had to wake up you guys have to wake up yes ap if not you are actually going to sit down there and watch your favorites go home then what i actually want to talk about is which is why you guys actually clicked on this video is kid wire and erica actually had sex in the big brother niger lounge in the hoh -H lounge how do i know about it you may be asking okay yesterday they were having a conversation that after the eviction show late in the night they were just having a conversation and then it's like Tolani Bad actually took a duvet to the hoh -H lounge and then erica was like ah she brought a duvet because she did she doesn't trust the duvet in the hoh -H lounge 
and Kidwaya was like, why did you say that? She was like, based on what she saw yesterday. I don't think there is this one here. She brought extra and said she's not, she doesn't trust the sheets. <laughs> oh, she's lying on her side. I see that. <laughs> no, because of what she saw yesterday, now. she's like... Did we call her? <laughs> I don't know. That beat that pussy up. <laughs> Your bad girl. Why did you tell her that? Now you scarred her. <laughs> Did you hear what Kidwire actually told Erica? Kidwire actually asked Erica, did I whoop that pussy well? And I'm like, Jesus Christ, so Coyote, 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 what has been going on? What has been going on? What have you been doing? Like, seriously, you have not been showing us these things? Like, seriously, you have been slying us, Coyote? That cameraman, eh, that cameraman would suffer for 600 years, as in, yes, yes, I'm saying it, because he has refused to be showing us what has been happening in the HOH lounge. So, Kidwire and Erica actually had actually knocked inside that hoh lounge anyway i'm not surprised i knew it happened but my annoyance now of making this video is that they did not show us is that i don't know about it they did not show me and it's making me very very angry i'm not happy about it that i did not see it with my eyes but from their conversation you will hear and then you this brings me to saying that erica has a coconut head yes i said it because they just gave it to strike because of these same guys and because of that same hoh -H lounge and this video that clip you just watched was at about to one or past one in the middle of the night and you don't give yourself sense so last last now prick will bring you come house hi erica change because i don't know your two strikes was given to you by kidwire was connected to the first one kidwire is still is still was still connected to the second one whispering to kidwire and spending night um, late night at the hoh lounge still connected to kidwire and then you know won't get sense you say you know go get sense you say you just won't fall your fans hands and you then call yourself their selves allies you won't fold their hands you know just make sense at all so just that's just the gist i just said let me come on here and give my people heads up that ah they have been doing it though, though we have not been seeing it. Coyote has refused to show us, but guess what? Your girl always have your back. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please, if you do, give it a thumbs up and leave me a comment below. I really love to hear from you guys. Thank you so much for subscribing. And if you have been watching up till this point, I guess it's about time you join the gang, join the league, join my fans, join my friends. Let's be just body, please. Hit on the red subscribe button and subscribe to the channel. And do not forget to turn on your notification bell so that you'll be informed whenever i post a new video for me to you is thank you so very much for coming to my channel and i will most definitely see you in my next video bye guys